Hi guys, welcome back to another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Noelia. I'm a curly hair enthusiast and I talk about all things curly, all things beauty, lifestyle, all that fun stuff. For today's video, a lot of you guys have asked me how do I detangle my hair because it seems like I have such thick, crazy hair and you guys want to know what I use to get through all the knots and all the mess. So what I decided to do is I'm actually going to show you guys my top four because I'm only going to part my hair in four sections. I'll show you guys my top four detanglers and part my hair in four sections so that way I can use each product in each section so you can see how they work for me in live time and yeah so if you guys are interested in seeing how I detangle my hair and what products I use and what are my faves don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like this video and turn on the alerts so you know when I post my next video and I'll throw my social handles down below so you guys can follow me on there as well and keep on watching. Alright, so what I'm going to do, I just freshly shampooed my hair and it is soaking wet because that is the only way that I can detangle my hair. If it's not dripping wet, like it's literally dripping wet right now, I cannot detangle my hair. My hair is a mess. So I'm going to part my hair in four sections just so we can get started. I don't have just one particular... Oh dear lord, I probably should have brought a brush. I'm going to freehand this. I'm going to be super gentle because your hair is very fragile when it's wet, so... Definitely something to be cautious of. So I'll part this up here. No particular style. I kind of just part it in four sections typically. I'm going to section them away. I'll do the same on this side. I know I really just jumped right into this video, but I don't like to make my videos super long. I mean, comment about down below if you guys don't mind having my videos super long, but I do feel like they can get a little boring when I make them so long, so I kind of just want to get straight to the point and not talk as much because I talk so much in my videos. Every time I go back and look, I'm always just like, oh dear God, I just talk so much. So I figured, moving forward, I'm going to do my best to just like get straight to the point. So these are in no particular order. I'm just picking them up as I see them. Um, some of them are not even specifically for that, but I use them for that because it gives me all the slip that I need and it detangles my hair really well. So, remember how I told you guys don't sleep on Trader Joe's? Well, the Tea Tree Tingle Conditioner is another one of my faves when it comes to detangling. Another product that is super affordable and I don't mind being super heavy handed with this product because it's hella affordable. So. All right, so I think something's stuck here. This is a difficult. My hands are so slippery. All right, so we're gonna... All right, so I'm gonna start off with this much for my section. I know this is not a dime size, but... So I just start raking it through, and I can already feel... You see? I did not detangle before this, just so you guys know. This is my hair. Freshly shampooed, absolutely no detangler, or detangling, I mean to say. So I try to finger detangle first before I even go in with a comb, because typically that makes it a lot easier because it loosens up the knots. And then to detangle, I typically, I use this brush for everything, but this is the Curl Keeper Flexi Brush. I love, love, love this brush. I'm telling you guys, it's amazing. So I always start at my ends. I always start at my ends. Be super gentle with your ends my way up. Can you see guys how that just, I can't make this up. Like this is, my hair loves that Trader Joe's conditioner. Look at this. I didn't even struggle. I did not even struggle. Actually this is going to be a really fascinating video to see, like to watch how each conditioner works in my hair and how quickly each one works. So that's that. Look, I'm pretty much detangled already. Look at that. Amazing. Look at this, guys. I'm so, so, so impressed. This is crazy. All right, well, I already knew that this was amazing, but I did not know how quickly it worked on me. Like, I didn't expect it to work this quick. Alrighty, and for my next section, Let's see which one I'm going to pick up next. 
Oh, so the next one I'm gonna use for this section, it's an oldie but a goodie, the Kinky Curly Not Today Leave-In Detangler. I will forever love this product. One of my go-tos when I was transitioning, I used to use this as a leave-in and style with it and detangle, like it did everything for me. I love it. So we're gonna use this one as well. This one's very lightweight, so it might so it might actually catch you off guard. You might not think that this would be good enough for thick, low porosity, coarse hair. But same thing, I have the same method for each one. So I just pretty much smooth it in. And I kind of just break the knots that I have at the bottom, but very lightly. Keep trying to rake it through. See the top is a little bit more knotty. But if I need more product, I'll grab more. Okay, we're starting to break through these knots. Yeah, it's very easy, smells so good. This one's a little bit more on the pricier side in comparison to the Trader Joe's one, but it does work phenomenal, like phenomenal. This is one that I'll always have in my stash, so. I'm gonna start with the bottom again and work my way up. Don't rip the brush through your hair. If it is tangled, just take your time with it. Do not rip not worth it just take your time and if you feel like your hair needs more product just go ahead and grab some more but I think mine is fine I just have to take my time with it this bottom half of my hair is naturally a little bit more dry and it's a little bit more matted so you can see why it's taking a little longer but it does a phenomenal job. See? Got right through my hair. My hair absorbs each and every ounce of that product. And there we have it. Another detangled section. All right, so this section's all set as well. I'm gonna go ahead and add a little bit more product just so as it's tied away, it's being conditioned. So I'm gonna go ahead and smooth it out like the other one. So for my next section, let me just take this one out. We'll use this as my next section. For my next section, we're going to use the main choice, exotic Kool-Aid Refreshing Cool Scalp and Nourished Laid Hair Sweet Papaya and Pineapple Infinite Conditioner. So you can actually use this conditioner as a co-wash, leave-in, detangler, rinse out, pre-poo, multi-purpose little conditioner here. And this one smells like a tropical paradise, guys. So this one's a little thicker than the rest. And I use about this much per section because you guys know how I am. Oh my god, it smells so good. It smells like what you'd like to smell like on a tropical vacation. I love it. it smells like pineapple, it smells like everything. I love it. All right, so I just start raking it through my hair. I need to get a trim, but I don't trust myself cutting my own hair, so I have to wait till things open again, because of course I waited way too long. All right, that's the hair. Hold up one second. Look at this. Look at this. Guys, this is everything. When I first tried this conditioner, I was so shook. Just like that. The section is super detangled. 
So I'm starting to miss the points to you guys as to why I love each product. So for as far as the main choice one, the second I tried this product, I remember just being so amazed at the fact that it just did all of that so quickly. And again, my hair was super dry and I hadn't washed my hair in about four days before this wash day. And my hair was in a bun for most of the time. So being that my hair is detangling this easy with these detanglers is saying a lot because my hair was in a crazy state in a bun you guys know how that gets my hair was like in a bun all frizzy like no care in the world these all work amazing i will link them all below i'm actually going to review the entire exotic kool-aid collection because i just tried all their products and i can't wait to share that with you guys i filmed it and i will be posting it very soon so you guys can see that last but not least is my last section to detangle I did not expect for this video to come out so smoothly I thought it was gonna be a little bit more difficult like look at this like like it's not it's not really okay let's see what happens so the next one is the Eden body peppermint tea tree all-natural hair milk so again this is not a detangler but I used it as a detangler this product is a little bit more watery and shook me the first time I tried it so. so it is a leave-in, but I have been using it as a detangler, conditioner type of thing because it has peppermint and tea tree and when I'm washing my hair, I love to have my scalp feeling invigorated and, and nice and fresh and it was just very soft on my hair, so I figured why not use it to detangle. You can do whatever you want with the products you have. So even if a product is a styler or even if a product is a leave-in, and it works really well as a detangler for you, you can use it as a detangler because there is no rules to this at all. So I like to go and massage my scalp with it as well to get those oils all up in there. It feels so good. Okay. And just like that, that section's also done. Guys, I am so shook. I did not expect this video to give me such good results. I mean, I knew it was going to detangle my hair really well, but I thought I was going to struggle a bit at least. But I have not struggled one bit. And again, my hair was so dry. I wish I would have shown you guys what it looked like before so you guys can kind of get an idea of what I'm talking about. My hair was super dry. But I did shampoo with the Blueberry Bliss Hair Rinse. And that alone also makes my hair very soft. So that also helps when you use a good shampoo rinse. So that section is also done as well. Look at that. Detangled. We are free. We are happy. I'm so here for all of this. So I'm going to go ahead and unravel my twists. And just detangle them all together at this point. Love when my wash days go very smoothly. Love it, love, love it. There's one more section under here. Perfect. So let's brush through it all. I have so many smells going on in my hair right now. I have pineapple, I have mint. I have a very neutral scent from the Kinky Curly. So if you guys are sensitive to scents and you prefer something that's not as heavily scented, then the Kinky Curly would be perfect for you because it does have a slight scent, but it's nothing overpowering. It's not overbearing. So I actually do have more conditioners that I use but I didn't want to make this video super long. I figured it would be better if I just demonstrated which ones worked best for me and showed you guys how it works on each section, which I'm actually really impressed with how it came out. I did not expect to not struggle. I thought I was gonna struggle at least a little bit, but I didn't really struggle that much, which I'm happy about. But as you guys saw in live time, 
these detanglers are legit they work really well my hair is super duper thick super coarse low porosity as low porosity can get and it is just very prone to getting tangles and I'm very on top of my hair so for the most part my hair doesn't get crazy crazy knots but it does get tangled up and when I washed my hair I was a little scared because I was just like you know like when you're washing your hair you're like oh god like my hands are not really slipping through it but it did feel very soft after the fact so maybe the shampoo also played a factor in how easily I detangle today but nonetheless those four right now are the ones I would run and grab if I needed to detangle my hair so I will add all the details about them down in the description box and if you have any questions or any recommendations on another detangler I should try, also comment them down below. But that's pretty much all. That's it. This is what my results look like. So as you guys can see, like, this is something. Like, my hair is thick, thick with three C's. <laughs> This hair is thick with three C's. I'm gonna go ahead and wash this out and deep condition, style, all that fun stuff. So if you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and turn on the alerts so you know when I post my next video. And if you have any questions, feel free to comment them down below. Any suggestions regarding some products I should try for you guys or any products you want me to try for you guys, comment those all down below. And again, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.